And to breaking news now, the bodies of three men killed in a helicopter crash near Terrace on Monday have just been recovered from the wreckage. Two of them were heli-skiing tourists from northern Italy. And according to a survivor, the third man was the pilot of the helicopter, which was based in Kelowna. CTV's Shannon Patterson reports on how the Italian victims are being remembered and what's next for the investigation. In the Bolzano Cathedral in northern Italy, hundreds of friends and family gathered on Saturday to remember 29-year-old Heiner Oberach and 35-year-old Andreas Wittmann, who died in a helicopter crash near Terrace this past Monday. The family organized yesterday this mass in the Cathedral of Bolzano, which was like a moment to to share this, uh, this sorrow, this pain. Oberach and Vidman were part of a group from Italy that booked a backcountry excursion with Northern Escape Hella Skiing, which is based in Terrace. They are all young people, um, sons of big families, uh, well-known families here in, in our country. And uh, yeah, they chose Canada because uh, it's like the, the paradise for, for, for skiing and Hella Skiing. Heiner Oberach's brother Jakob, one of four men who survived the crash, described the terrifying aftermath. He told uh, that uh, after the crash, uh, he saw like uh, uh, blood everywhere. He has uh, both uh, legs broken and uh, near him was his brother uh, who was dead, uh, Heiner Oberauch, Heinz uh, Oberauch. And on the other side, there was uh, Andreas Wittmann, which is the second of the, of the Three victims because the third is the pilot of the helicopter. Skyline Helicopters out of Kelowna has been providing staff and equipment for Northern Escape heliskiing for 20 years. It won't confirm the third victim is their pilot, saying that's up to authorities to release. Because of poor weather conditions, all three victims' bodies remained in the wreckage on the mountain for six days. I think uh, that uh, everybody would like to have a body to, to cry on and... Um, uh, it's quite difficult to to understand why it uh, takes uh, so long. Late this afternoon, the president of Northern Escape Heliskiing released a statement saying in part, once our teams rescued the four injured people off the mountain, the helicopter accident site was closed. So we relied on the RCMP, Terra Search and Rescue and others to take on the important responsibility of recovering those lost. We are pleased that today, thanks to the dedication of those groups, the recovery mission of the three individuals has also been completed. Members of the Italian victims' families are now in BC to claim their loved ones' bodies. While RCMP and the Transportation Transportation Safety Board try to determine why the backcountry heliskiing adventure ended in tragedy. Shannon Patterson, CTV News.